bring it to point guard position. Those of you who live in Jersey either love me or hate me uh, right now, and I'm uh, not really concerned about that. Crawford, the starting one for the Warriors, was the first casualty of Don Nelson's decision to rest his starters for entire games so younger players can get more playing time. Nelly said that he has learned over the years, and he's been in the NBA for 737 years, that simply sitting a player for an, for an entire game is better than playing everyone limited minutes. Hmm. Nelly recently won his 1300th game and he's second all-time in wins, so you have to respect his decision and his acumen. But that doesn't mean we have to agree with it or like it. In fact, I totally disagree with it. And I hate it for the Warriors as well as bruised fantasy owners. Friday versus Charlotte, Jamal Crawford, DNP. He had 50 against the Bobcats earlier this year. I don't see the logic in that move, Nelly. Sunday against Utah, Steven Jackson, DNP. Next Friday, I should say this Friday, against whoever, Andres Biedrich, DNP, and Corey Maggetti. Yes, in a game to be determined, he will be a DNP as well. Sweet, sweet. I'm giving you the pop of it. Sweet right here. Here's the deal. Uh, on another note for the Golden State Warriors, who since making their ascension to one of the hot teams in the league, has like made nothing but bad decisions ever since. Monte Ellis, okay, let's talk about this. If Nelly wants to rest his starters, then why not rest Monte for the rest of the season so his surgically repaired ankle has ample time to heal? Monte is already on the shelf because of occasional stiffness in the ankle, and the Warriors are way out of the race. So what's the point? Yes, freaks, I have gone from free Monte, yes, free, free Monte, to rest Monte here on the Fantasy Show. I'd love to see him back, but the dude's obviously not healthy, so I, it's just, uh, let's move on.